we introduce Neural Cloth Sim. The first neural cloth simulator that models the cloth quasi-statics as a neural deformation field using thin shell theory. Neural Cloth Sim represents the surface deformation as a coordinate-based neural network and is supervised with the laws of Kirchhoff Love Thin Shell. While existing cloth simulators produce realistic cloth deformations that obey different types of boundary conditions, their operational principle remains limited in several ways. For instance, they operate on discrete surface representations with a fixed spatial resolution. Moreover, they require comparably large amounts of memory to store the simulations. Owing to discretization, simulations at different meshes, resolutions are inconsistent with each other. This limits the simulators from offering adaptive sampling to downstream tasks that query or modify the simulated states. In response to these limitations, we propose Neural Cloth Sim, a new approach to cloth quasi-statics using continuous thin shells. Neural Cloth Sim encodes the quasi-static deformation in neural network weights. Here, the input to the network are the parametric coordinates on the cloth, and an optional temporal coordinate, and output, are the three-dimensional states until equilibrium. Thus, the surface deformation is modeled as a continuous coordinate-based neural deformation field, or NDF for short. We model clothes as Kirchhoff love thin shells and the cloth quasi-statics is supervised by minimizing the potential energy of the thin shell deformation. We show how to train a neural network that converges to a physically plausible cloth simulation obeying various boundary conditions while avoiding unbalanced gradients. NDF is memory efficient and adaptive, as it allocates network capacity to the deformation details as they arise during the cloth deformation. Upon convergence, our method encodes the learned quasi-static state of the thin shell that can be queried continuously in space. It allows surface state sampling at arbitrary spatial resolutions without retraining. Next, we present the experimental results. Neural Cloth Sim operates on continuous neural fields and produces realistic cloth deformations. We model different types of initial geometries and apply various boundary conditions. Our simulator generates the characteristic folding, buckling and twisting effect of sleeves and skirts. Further, we visualize the evolution of a simulation state over the training iterations, starting from a noisy initialization to the converged state. Within a few minutes of training, NDF generates reasonable simulations, which then converge within 30 minutes to one hour. Neural Cloth Sim can incorporate further priors learnt from data. For instance, it can be trained jointly with multiple materials by conditioning the NDF on material properties such as thickness, elasticity and mass. At test time, our method supports simulation queries with linear interpolation in the material space. A user can interrupt the NDF training at any point to redesign the simulation parameters. As an example, consider a simulation pre-trained with a fixed reference state and external force. Once converged, we fine-tune the NDF with smoothly varying external force at each iteration. This leads to the motion of cloth towards the instantaneous force direction. In the second example, we smoothly vary the reference poses and the corresponding boundary position, generating novel edited simulations. Editing reference pose leads to the motion of the cloth towards a fixed force direction but originates from varying initial poses. Fine tuning is faster than simulation from scratch and offers querying of physically plausible intermediate simulations.
at different discretization or spatio-temporal resolutions, existing differentiable simulators lead to unpredicted outcomes, such as different folds, wrinkles and drapes. Our continuous formulation overcomes this limitation of existing discrete approaches and leads to consistent simulations when NDF is evaluated at varying resolutions. Thanks for watching. Please check our paper for more details.